drop. We, we the droppers, nigga. We the drop. Security want to check. Fuck a check. I am not that I nigga. Not that Catch nigga. my bro, she kill her. Shoot his face and I will not stop. Pull up for the three. I will miss it. I am not Ben Simmons. Fucking bomb on top of your block and shit like TNT. Disrespect us, you D.I.E. Get put the B.D. I've been reading y'all comments and seeing y'all questions. Y'all asking me, right? <laughs> Do we run out of story times? We want the story times. Where are they? Why are you slowing down, nigga? I am working to be the best YouTuber in the fucking world, nigga. I'm upgrading the content. After I saw what y'all did to season one of the show, y'all got every episode to 100k. The vid I did with Phantom, y'all got the 600k. I said, oh. I might have to leave this fucking chair and start going outside to do videos. So I've been doing videos and story time's never really gonna stop, y'all. Um, I'm still living. I didn't die yet, nigga. But that's besides the point. We're gonna hop straight into the story time, right into that bitch, after you click the like button. Click the like button. Let's get into the story time, though. So I know y'all love the story times with my family, so I'm like, no. I gotta really give them some heat. Of course, y'all know what aunt I was fighting. Comment it below if you're a real OG. You know what aunt I was fighting. If you're new here, my family is a mess. Yep, my family is a mess. But if you don't know how my story times work, I start all the way from the beginning. I gotta give you the origin story. Even if you already know the origin story, it's gonna be entertaining every time, nigga. So everybody got a mom side and a dad side of the family. You feel me? Everybody. You have a dad. He probably not there, but you got one. I hit, I hit, I hit a nerve, didn't I? It's cool. I hit my own nerve. Tell my dad come back. Look. So you got a mom and you got a dad. You feel me? I don't really know my dad's side of the family, but I know my mom's side of the family very well. And they are. I just need one word. They're bullshit. That's what it is. Damn, it looked like I was being sarcastic. I really had to pull that out. They're bullshit. But back then, they was like fake unified. Like my mom and all her sisters, they was like fake close. You feel me? Now, being young, I didn't know I was going to hate these people later. So, I'm sitting there telling these these people, called my aunts, I love them and all this shit. I'm sitting there being delusional. If you are OG, then you know where the story time took place. Took place at my grandmom's house. If you if you not, you feel me, like, on a lower end from the slums, then uh, you don't know. But grandmom's house is the place you always go and you ain't got nowhere to go. You feel me? Shout out grandmom. She was annoying, though. And mind you, my grandmom is an asshole. Like, she drank beer and scream all day. Beer and scream. Beer and scream. It's crazy. My aunt is annoying, too. Yo, they're, they're fucking annoying. That's besides the point. All this was my mom's fault. Really, all of it. Her thing was, she watched me all the time. And I, I get it as a parent. As a parent, it's like, damn, I watch you all the time. I want to have some me time. It's That is not a crime. So if you're a parent and you're watching right now, that is not a crime. You want some me time, that's cool. You feel me? Per when I get older, if I want to fuck on somebody's mom, I want them to be able to have somebody, you know, watch their kid. How we going to fuck? You know, I'm not even the type of nigga to fuck in front of kids. So it's gonna have to be babysitters and that's fine. It's a job and that's a profession niggas is babysitters nannies and all that You don't think the 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 rate of your mom getting smashed go up while you getting watched it does bro Substantially it does really but she was picking the wrong people She thought oh this family they gonna treat him with care. They really going you feel me. They going uh No, no, my aunt was not the right person to watch me at all she knew, yo, she knew I didn't like, she knew I didn't like uh, my aunt. She knew that. And I expressed that to her personally. I think my mom just be like, oh, that's your aunt. Y'all going to fuss and tussle? No, we're not going to fuss and tussle. She got a 10 year, 10 year age gap on me. Fuss and tussle is something you do with your, your siblings, your cousins. She ain't my fucking cousin or my sibling. And if you don't know who I'm talking about, I'm talking about my aunt. I'm sure you read the title, right? Because if you read the title, it's right above the like button. Click it. What you talking about? Click that shit, nigga. Click that. Nigga, square the fuck up then, nigga. Square the fuck up then. Square the fuck up then, nigga. Square the fuck up then. Square up. Now look, it's two people you just don't trust. You're not supposed to trust them. It's literally written inside a book. And my aunt is one of those things. You don't trust a person who yells and beat their kids excessively to watch your kids. You don't trust her. She don't even watch her kids correctly. Why would we trust her? And then it's, it's uh, pretty girls that wear wigs. Don't trust them either. They break your heart. So it was like, let me see. I don't know what year it was. Y'all know that game where it's the toys, right? And you sit them on this little circle thing. It's called the portal. You sit on the portal and you can see the actual... I'm about to look it up. It sound crazy. It was tough. My mom got me that shit and I was losing my marbles about it. Skylanders. That was 2011? Nah, couldn't have been 2011. 
Oh, it was Trap Team. That was 2014. So I was, I was 11. Okay. All right, y'all. So I was 11 at the time. I had just got the new Skylanders, bro. I was happy as shit. My mom bought it for me. They had the pack with the portal, the game, and like three action figures for like $80, bro. This one GameStop was in. Y'all remember GameStop? Oh my God, bro. Y'all just, yo, y'all really got a peep. That's how I know I'm getting old, bro. We gonna be able to say like, yo, y'all remember GameStop? Niggas don't even go to, <laughs> niggas don't go to um, GameStop no more. It's probably because they was sitting there trying to give you $2 for your PlayStation the day after it just came out. They was real heavy on burning niggas keep trying treat treat it like a pawn shop matter of fact yeah they did that shit to me i gave them niggas like 30 games in a system nah fuck them niggas fuck you game stop that's what the fuck you get anyway skylanders just came out we living at my grandmom house that's where we at so far skylanders just came out i'm living at my grandmom house shout out grandma my family annoying i don't fuck with them now that's where we at you feel me so the game just came out and i had the back room so in the back room it felt like it felt like a fort it felt secluded because in order to come to the back room you have to walk down the hall and deliberately be on my dick to walk into my room and you feel me it would have just let me know you coming to fuck with me i had the back room it's no other rooms near me you know you come up the steps it's a room right there there's a room right there and you gotta walk back you feel me you gotta walk back you gotta say, you gotta walk for a whole like 15 seconds and say, yo, I'm about to fuck his day up. You feel me? I'm letting y'all know that because my aunt came to the back. Exactly. I'm back there. I'm playing Skylanders all day. I'm not even eating, bro. It's so crazy. My aunt had to say, yo, come eat. Mind you, when you a young boy, bro, you really don't appreciate food. I'm older now and I appreciate food. You feel me? Food high as shit. I don't know. That shit, I don't know, bro. I should have appreciate those nuggets, man. When you off somebody else, buck, that shit just tastes so much better. Now the nigga buy me food, what? Oh, thank God that food make me happy as shit. Thank God, nigga. Praise the Lord. I start believing in the Lord. Damn. That shit got me reminiscing about what I can't afford now. This life shit hard. But look, she called me to get my food. I come out and get the food. I try to bring it upstairs. This one, my grandma act like if we only eat in the dining room, she was going to get rid of the roaches. Like, we know she wasn't eating in her room. But, yeah, now I can say all that shit because I'm older. Yeah, we knew you was eating in your room and you was the reason. Yeah, all them dishes. Bring them cups down. I'm thirsty. Keeping the cups in her room. I was talking to some girl last week and she was like, oh, roaches? Looking like this. I'm like, damn, bitch. We must have been really dirty at my grandma's house. I don't know. It was it was common that we was really in the slums. But they wouldn't let me eat upstairs, so I ate uh, ate downstairs. Went back to my room. You know, an adult trying to piss you off when they call your name. Oh, Sharad, 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 Sharad. Want call your name all loud, Sharad? You say, huh, huh, huh? What? Yeah, huh, huh? Niggas don't say nothing back. It's crickets. It's crickets. It's it's, it's niggas' mouths is closed. And then you say, and then the, the time you don't you don't go downstairs, or you like, all right, she don't want to say nothing, I ain't saying nothing either. You sit down, I know you heard me just standing third, try to slap you all up, do all the extra shit. So she keep calling me, I'm giving her the respect, I'm like, yo, I'm going downstairs, what's up? Um, why you didn't clean, wipe the table off after you ate? Oh shit, my fault, oh, wipe the table off real quick. Why you rushing? Is it not a good job? Just stop rushing, do it. You can get back to that game, really nitpicking. Like, really just making a problem out of nothing. So she already pissing me off. I'm already pissed. I'm already pissed. I'm already pissed off. So, you feel me? She called me the next time. Shara, Shara, Shara. Just that third. Come come watch TV or something. Go, go read a book. You on that game all day. Your mom spoil you. You too much. Jealousy? Question mark? Um, fuck. So, um, that's going on. You feel me? Keep calling me. So, you know how I told you. I'm just going to ignore it this time. So, she called me. She, um, Shara, Shara. Yeah, because whatever you got to say, tell me from here so I can knock it out and get back to my game. And mind you, this before, and Skylanders, I wasn't playing online. This was a local game, bro. This this a one-player, two-player game. If you're not in that room, you ain't, you ain't enjoying this shit, nigga. So, and mind you, I, I only said that because if this was an online game, she would have had to eat a dick. If I'm in the middle of a Fortnite match, I'm in a 2K, uh, you feel me? I'm running twos, I'm running threes. If this if this a real online game, you feel me? She would have been eating Franks. So she don't even know how blessed she was because this would be a whole different story time because I wouldn't have moved from my seat. And she, she frankly, would have just been pissed. But back to the story, she called me, Sherrod, just stand the third. I don't answer this time. I'm not answering. You don't want anything. Who's the child, me or you? 
she don't want anything and mind you she high she smoked you feel me so as a kid i used to look at the adults and i'd be like dang bro it's a part of your daily routine to have weed cigarettes and i'm looking and i'm like this shit all stink all that shit stink to me i still don't smoke weed to this day i don't smoke cigarettes you feel me like i'm i'm, I'm not with it so she high so i'm i'm tired of her she got me re-wiping tables three times like i'm a waiter shit is just getting really awkward and weird fast um and i'm doing this is one mission i'm like damn can i knock out a mission this bitch Where's her consideration? Like, where's her Where's her respect? She's not really... And then her main thing, my aunt main thing was respect your elders. So you're an elder. All right, cool. When I, when I say that you old, now you offended. Now you don't ask a lady her age. And now I'm rude and all that because you old as shit. All right, so you an elder or not. Then I'm trying to really get into that. And then it's respect your elders. Let's say I consider you an elder. After that... When you start disrespecting me, where does when, when does your your respect fly out the window? When when do I say, damn, you've been disrespecting me? Fuck your respect. When do I say like, fuck your respect because you've been disrespecting me? It's never no moment when I could just take a step back and say, I don't, I'm not gonna lie, I'm not liking your mouth. But she could take a she could take a step back and say, yeah, I ain't liking your mouth. Nah, bro. I knew about equality before I grew up. I'm 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 feeling that shit. I'm fighting that shit. I was like Martin Luther King, fighting for kids, right? I'm telling this bitch, I'm telling her like, yo, you don't, you want somebody to respect you, you're not respecting them. And I'm not even her kid. I think she was just picking on me. Mind you, the whole time this happening, my mom is out with her boyfriend at Atlantic City having a time of her fucking life. She loved Atlantic City. Oh, Atlantic City with my two best friends. It was, uh, one, one of her best friends was this gay guy. And then, um, it was this girl. She was, she was fat though. She was fat. Um, mind you, great trio, cause my mom's small as shit. My mom was my mom was five foot. Four eleven. My mom was four eleven. That's why I'm not tall. Mom, no, that's why I'm not tall. <laughs> that's why I'm not tall. Yo, I was texting some girl the other day. She like, yo, how tall is you? I'm like, yo, I'm six two. I knew I never was gonna see her ever again in life, but she like, oh, you so tall. I had to get the tall, like, I had to get, like, the tall appreciation. I wanted to see what that shit felt like. That shit felt great. I'm currently trying to sleep more to, uh, get those inches and shit. So I'm sitting in my seat. I'm like, I know this bitch ain't calling me again. I don't say anything. I continue my mission. Frankly, I was losing. I was on the verge of losing my mind due to that. So she was just adding on, not really caring about my mental stress. I'm playing the game. She said, I know you fucking hear me, this, that, and the third. So I hear the, I hear the anger rising from her, but I'm like, see, bitch, you see how I feel when I got to get out my chair. So I'm glad she's feeling these feelings. I'm thinking this is about to help the situation, about to help her understand that, yo, you feel me? That's how that's how it be, you feel me? She comes stomping up the steps. Dum, 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 heavy ass feet, wearing clogs. She busts through the back door, mind you, walks through the long ass hallway to be on my dick. Walks through the long ass hallway, boom, bust the door open. You ain't hear me? I said, you ain't hear me? I said, huh? Right? Y'all remember that, right? I said, huh? I said, huh? Huh? Yes! I said, I said all that. She, I heard you. I said, I heard you. You see, we the same niggas, twin. We locked in. You heard me, I heard you. We both didn't respond. So if you get it, why don't you get how I get it? I get it, we get it. It's the same shit. I'm playing the game. And she like, but I called you. I said, but I'm playing the game. She said, get the fuck off the game. I said, I can't pause it during this moment. It was literally, I'm in the middle of jumping between lava rocks on these little ass like islands. I'm jumping from island to island in between this lava. If I fall down, bro, the game is over, literally. And I spent so much time on this job. So she come up, grabs the controller, mind you. Her big ass hands, grab my hands, mind you. Grab my hands, she could just grab everything. She grabbed the situation. The controller is like this. She don't grab my the, the controller or or like grab my hand. She grabbed the situation. Her hand kind of just went and grabbed my hands and the controller. Rips them up. Pops a nail off. She, you just broke my fucking nail. Your mom paying for these. Now, I'm like, bro, you ain't you ain't about to get a full set on my dukes. <laughs> you feel me? Hit her with the Kawhi lab. <laughs> you ain't getting a full set on my dukes, bro. You're not. You're not. I said, no, she's not. So now, now it's, it's. The, now, now in this conversation we having is confirming the beef that we had that we didn't, you feel me, address. Yes, it's beef. You're not getting a full set on my dukes and pass me my controller. I said, gave my controller. She said, you don't even know why I called you. I said, you, you came in here to mess with me. You just messing with me. She like, called you because I, I, I want you to play with your cousin. Just stand a third, all this, play with your cousin. I said, that's fine. I didn't break your nail though. 
She, your mom is paying for it. Um, she called her son, my cousin. Mind you, I'm putting these up. I'm not close to little bro. I was never a fake ass young boy. I, I wasn't, I wasn't friendly, but I know how to make friends, bro. Like some people don't know how to make friends. They'll go in a place and shut the fuck up. I'm not shutting the fuck up. I'm trying to outshine every nigga in the room. I am him. So I know how to make friends. This nigga ain't my friend. If he was my friend, he would be back this bitch. Cause I would have called him. I'm a great friend. I would have said, yo bro, I'm playing the game, which is extremely fun. Do you want to join in nigga? Easy. I didn't call him, but she wanted me to play with him so bad. I'm like, all right, come on. She called him back. He come in the back room. He playing the game, all this. Not not even playing the game. I'm, he he want to play the game and all that. I grabbed the other controller. I hooked the other controller up. I'm trying to help this nigga. It's not letting this nigga play. Bro, it's either me or you. It literally, it, it, it's literally saying only one player, and it's going to be me, nigga. Duh. It's my system. Um, So I'm letting him know, like, all right, hold up, bro. You're going to wait. We're going to take turns, mind you. After you complete the mission... It'd be a little bonus round where you could get extra points by fighting the people. I'm like, I'm gonna give them the little bonus rounds at the end. She busts in the room while I got the controller and said, she say her son name, did you play yet? He said, no. I said, yeah, he's waiting his turn. I thought y'all both was playing. I explained to her, yo, the controllers are broken. They're broken, bro. Um, And yeah, it's my turn first. He got next. So she said, what's next? I said, when I'm done the mission. And she think I'm being smart. She think I'm being an asshole because we, we bump ahead. So she think I'm being an asshole and basically saying like, whenever I feel like it or when I'm done. No, nigga, when the mission is done, it literally show how much you have completed. At that point, I had like 67% completed or 60 something. And I'm like, he's going to get it soon, nigga. I'm not, I'm not super ass. Like, <laughs> It's gonna get done. I've been knocking out missions even when you was calling me, bro. You feel me? Like, you the one who slowed me up. I'm like, he gonna go next. She, no, nah, let him go now. I said, no, I'm in the middle of something. Or at least, bare minimum, when I die, she, when you die, give it up, though. I said, all right. She walks out the room. Mind you, now I'm mad. I'm like, bro, I told you, you when you going, you said, okay, your mom come in here. Now is, I know, no, I didn't get to play yet. Bro, you a part of her just snapping on me right there. Now, now he's a weird ass nigga in my, in, in my eyes. Everybody, I look around, left, right. I'm, I'm looking up. Look, weirdos, weird house, weird people, weird, 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 weird. Fuck. What we doing? I just want to play my game. Mind you, I'm fed up with this shit. I said, you know what, bro? You want to play? You could play, bro. You could play. I give bro the controller. I grabbed the basketball. I'm going outside. I wasn't the young boy who like, yo, mine, mine, mine. I'm stingy. So at the end of the day, bro, I just be wanting to enjoy my own company. I really enjoy my company, my own company a lot. Like for me to function as like a regular working human being, I literally need time where nobody is fucking talking to me. It's like, yo, everybody shut the fuck up. And I didn't notice this until I got older, but I've always been like, even to like squeezing myself into like tight corners in the crib or behind the couch or, or weird places. And my mom like, bro, what are you doing? You feel me? It's like, it, it, I look like a weirdo. I'm behind the couch, squeezed in between it. Nobody could see me. And, and I'm just watching YouTube. It's just like, bro, that's time I need by myself because everybody pissed me off, genuinely. I think genuinely, if I love you, I got a high tolerance for you, but everybody genuinely pissed me off. I think that's what made me like have a smart ass mouth. It's just like, bro, shut the fuck up. Cause like, I like getting on your nerves without cursing at you. I think that's my thing. Might be bipolar though. So I go outside. Um, well, no, I grabbed the ball. I put my clothes on or whatever. As I'm walking down the steps, she said, where are you going? I said, going outside. She said, no, you're not. I said, my mom let me go outside all the time. I've been outside every day. What are you saying? <laughs> Simple. Like, I'm not even going, ugh. Let's just save that. Because now it seems like, oh, we, we clashing here. So you think I ain't about to go shoot this basketball. Bitch, I'm Stephen Curry. I'm going to shoot this bitch. So she uh, said, no, you're not. <laughs> Boom. Close that bitch behind me. You see the hand though? That's the handle. You feel me? Huh? Huh? Close that bitch. I kept walking. I keep walking. I'm walking to the park. I'm playing ball or whatever. I'm doing my thing. Surprisingly, she didn't come after me. I had a nice time playing ball. I come back. She's pissed, right? She has my Skylanders wrapped all up, right? She got it wrapped all up, and, and now she got it in her bag. Mind you, my mom and my aunts used to have big-ass pocketbooks. Everything used to be in there. It used to be a section of mail, uh, a weapon, which could be a gun, mace, or a, a knife, <laughs> cords, and snacks. Swear to God, it sounds unbelievable, but I promise you, they used to have a pocketbook on a, on a joint like this. Cause I remember, Mom, I hold your pocketbook, I got you. Had me down here, you feel me? Turn me, <laughs> hold little baby pose. I'm here with it when I when I when I hold that shit. You feel me? That shit bring me here. It bring my mood down and my and my. You feel me? All that. I come back and she got my game in her purse. The portal is wrapped up. The little toys I ain't had that many at the time. And her purse, all that. Because I'm like, where my game? She, I got it. You get it back when your mom come out since you don't want to listen. Boom. So now she power tripping me. You feel me? Now she power tripping me. You're not J. Cole. You're not.
you're not. So now, I don't ever say nothing to her. Because she be so high that I'm like, bro, I'm going to catch you lacking. And it's just runs after that. So my, my grandma got steps, like a full set of stairs. But at the halfway point, it's a wall. So you can't see who's coming down. You can just hear. So I walk up the steps halfway and I sit behind the wall. And I'm like, all right, I'm going to wait till she go back in the kitchen, go outside to smoke or do something else. This bitch is camping my game. She's camping my game. Give me my game. She's camping my game. So I'm sitting there. I noticed, damn, she's sitting here long. Mind you, she on the phone with her friend arguing about is if the earth is flat or not. Oh, yeah, no, just then the third. I remember the conversation because I'm sitting there and the bitch almost made me believe the earth was flat. She argued. You're going to hear that, oh, da, da, just that a third. Why are you arguing about if the earth is flat or round? You don't have a passport. Does it matter? You'll never be able to see. Give me my game. So I'm tired of waiting this shit out. I go downstairs. I don't know what my move's going to be, but this was basically me letting her know, like, yeah, I'm coming for that shit. Nigga, I'm getting it back in blood. I walk past her. I go to get some snacks, just that third. You can't eat no snacks. Just that third. You had too many snacks today. I open the fruit snack pack, throw them, all them bitches in my mouth. My bad. And her face. And her face. So, this me saying, all right, hold the game. Now, I'm going to just keep getting under your skin. I'm going to keep dicking you. So, I'm eating a fruit snack. I'm, I grab another pack. I'm in the kitchen. Mind you, she in the living room. Shh. I want it too. I'm hungry. If you hungry, you get food then. You going to make it? I ain't making you nothing. You better make some noodles. Never mind then. I'm going to just keep eating fruit snacks. I'm getting, I'm getting real. I'm getting right under her skin. I go upstairs. Now, I'm upstairs. All you got to do to a parent is act like you having fun, bro. Act like you having fun. I'm back there like, yo. <laughs> Uh, she come up, she come up there, you too loud. And and I frankly, I'm just tired of your attitude. You need to quiet down. I said, it's, it's me having, bro, and, and the best thing you can do is be transparent. I, I, my grandma taught me that, look. I said, you're mad because I'm having fun. Why is that hurting you? You're grown. She said, what? Swung at me. I dipped it. She stopped fucking playing with me. Just down the third. Bitch, don't swing at me for you initiate war. I'm a ruthless leader. I'm letting them bitches fly on anybody. Once you 10 year, once you 10 years older than me, before I hit 18, I can beat your fucking ass. That's the rule. Before 18, if a girl is 10 years older than you, you can whip her ass. Because she mentally need to lock in. You're a child. You know? And that's and that's the rule I, I really lived by. So, I, I said, I said, don't swing at me, whatever, boom, boom, boom. She said, stop fucking playing with me. Walk out the room. All right, cool. She walks out of the room. She mad as shit. She frustrated. You know, that's her thing. You feel me? Mind you, she went to therapy. Take that shit out with your therapist, bitch. But, um... She mad as shit. I still don't got my game. My game downstairs. So I decided, yo, I'm going to be petty. You took everything out of my room. I can't do nothing. I antagonize you. I get in trouble. Whatever. I'm going to go downstairs then. I'm going to chill with you. So while you have your little flat earth around earth conversation, I'm going to be around here stomping my foot on these flat ass tiles. Yes, sir. I was down there dancing, having a good time. I actually started to enjoy myself. I was uh, watching TV. Mind you. My grandma, bro, if it's one thing, if it's one thing she care about, bro, it's her sofa, bro. She do not play about her sofa. You try to sleep on her sofa, now the leather cracking, now she mad. How we got a uh, uh, fucking big ass house that's dirty with roaches, but you got a good couch. Like, what? But she care about her appliance, for real, for real, because she, she love her dining table, too, and her TV. She had just got this big ass TV in February um, during income tax time. So she got this big ass 60 inch. She got this nice leather couch. The ends recline and all that. So I'm down there. I'm chilling. I'm playing on the TV. I'm actually enjoying myself. I think this pissed her off again. She said, turn it down. I said, no. Fuck you talking about? You, I let you take my game. I let you do all that other shit, but you ain't doing that shit over here. I don't do that shit. I said, no. She passed me the fucking remote to stand at third, get up. Mind you, she talking all this shit. I said, no. Nah. So I'm holding my hand like this. You know, she gripping me up, boy, all this. I'm pushing her. She, you hit me back. We really getting into it, right? So she grabbed the remote. She slammed the remote. Now nobody watching nothing. So she slammed the remote. Now nobody watching nothing. Fuck you talking about. I said, mm -hmm. push her. I make that noise. I push her, right? I push her. She come back. Boom, hit me in my chest. I stand up, my fist boiled up. She, what you gonna do? I'm boy your fucking fist. If I give you a, if I give you a reason to cry, I just stand up there, all this, talking all this other shit. I'm like, I'm doing all this. She walk away. I thought so. Bitch, the game ain't over. Now I'm walking her down like this. I'm walking behind her. She stop, I stop. I'm walking behind her. She stop, I stop. She stop fucking following me. I'm like this. She stopped following me, mugged me. As she mugged me, I grabbed her hand. 
Pull her close. Elbow. Bow! John Jones her ass. Stop playing with me. Stop playing with me. Pull around. Hmm. Hit her. Right? Now she mad as shit. I run. Cause she grab, bro. You know how they be playing like, yo, uh, Spanish grandmoms grab the, uh, grab the, grab the slipper. Nah, not my aunt. She grabs the pan of food. Throw the pan of food at me. Miss. Mind you, I knew she ain't have an arm from that one time we played football as a family. You don't have an arm. Stop wasting our food. You could have at least got the hit. She chasing me or whatever. I, it's an ottoman. An ottoman is that thing that be in the middle of the floor you put your feet up on. I'm running around the ottoman so she can't catch me. She bumps the fucking TV where her big ass body, mind you, I told y'all she a heavy set built Joan. Mind you, her son is a bitch. He did nothing. You were, you was my same age. If you pulled that same stunt on on, on my mom, I'd have beat you the fuck up. We'd have jumped you. Anyways, yeah, yeah, um, you pussy. I don't know if I said that. But um, yo, she bumps the TV, John, right? So she looks, she try to catch the TV at 60 inch. The TV fall on her, boom, right? And the TV stand. So now it's on her legs. Everything fall down on her. Boom. She under. She, Shirai, help me. Help me, help me, help me. Shirai, help me. I said, oh, my God. I ran over there. I said, oh, my God. I ran over there. I looked down at her. She said, help me. I'm looking down on her. I shake my head. No, I said, no. No, I can't. She had, like, this little pole. It's this little pole thing we had. She was using that to, like, Try to pull herself from under that. I kicked her hands from the pole. I said, get off the pole. It's going to break. <laughs> I kick her. I look down on her. I said, oh, no. I ain't forget. Fuck, no. Kick her hand from the pole. I'm like, yeah, you're going to break the pole. Watch out. Uh, it was a pipe. It was a pipe. Not a pole. A pipe. It was a pipe in the, in the crib. It was like, yo, you pull this pipe. You know, well, you don't know what you breaking. Get off the pipe. Kick her hand. She, I'm gonna fuck you up. She trying to get from under it, but her leg is really caught on the TV stand. The TV is dick, by the way. My grandma is gonna be furious. You already broke the remote. The TV stand is now in shambles because we got it from Family Dollar, and the TV is broke. And February ain't coming for another year, and that's the only time my grandma got money. So she trying to crawl from under that John. I'm like, if she get from out of this, she gonna hurt me. I grab a pillow from the couch. Bow. Hit her ass with another pillow. Bow! Hit her with a pillow. She pussy. Oh, this. She get a, a hold of, like, my pants leg. So as she grabbing my pants leg, I'm stumping her out like a roach. Get off me. Mm, mm, stumping out. Get the fuck off me. I'm stumping her out like a roach. Get off me. Right? She get from under the TV. She chasing me again. I run upstairs. All the way upstairs to the back room. I close the back room. Right? So I'm holding. I'm, she. Doom. 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 She prying herself in there but after you open the door like if you walk in if you walk in a room right if you walk in a room once you look straight it's another door it's a closet it's like a small entrance but then as you go into the room like it get a little bigger i got my legs against that door and i got my back against the door she trying to get in so i'm not stronger than her but you not about to smush my body my legs strong as shit you feel me so i'm holding like this right so i'm holding like this right she trying to get in. She like, I'm going to fuck you up. Just stand the third, all this. I'm just waiting it out. 30 minutes go by. She try again on some random shit. 30 minutes go by. It's quiet. I thought she went downstairs. I heard her footsteps. I never heard her footsteps come back up. Now she at the door. Boom. Boom. Randomly. I'm going to get you, pussy. 30 minutes go by. I, I fell asleep, yo. I fell asleep. I open my eyes. Her arm is through the jaw, like in between the crack of the door. I slipped a little bit. I slipped. She still couldn't get in. I slammed my back back. Boom. Her arm gets stuck. Ah! She pulled it out. <laughs> she pulled her arm out. She pussy, I'm going to fuck you up. Boom. She kicking the jaw with her feet now. So now it's hurting my back. Ugh. It's just me straight taking the damage. I'm, 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 I'm the brace for the door. Like I'm taking all that shit. Boom. Boom! I hear the front door open. Hey! Oh, fuck no! Fuck no! Bro, my grandma walked right in. My grandma walked right in. She just was around the corner drinking. She nice and drunk, and she ready to turn it up. She said, oh, fuck no! Oh, fuck no! Oh, fuck no! Bro, she kept repeating it. You, bro. Bro, you'd have, you'd have, you'd have thought my grandma was retarded. She kept saying, oh, fuck no. 
she came upstairs who broke my TV. My, my, my aunt said, I broke it because Shirai was... You should have lied. She said, I broke it because Shirai was running around. And I was trying to catch him just down a third. My grandma and my aunt start knuckling. My grandma, I guess my grandma was wrapped out. And my aunt was always late on her part of the rent. What? This was my grandma time to shine. My, I come out the door, I open it because I hear scuffling. I'm like, I know that ain't my grandma. My grandma, I'm giving her the fucking deuce. Fuck, bro, she got her hair. She hitting all these. All these. All these, my aunt hitting all this. Mind you, she did crack my grandma with a good jaw. I was thinking like, yo, I should go out and help. But I don't know if my grandma, see, the thing is, all right, she's sharp, but how good is my grandma's stamina? Because if my grandma's stamina is low, even if we 2v1 her, my aunt's going to win. I know her stamina high. You feel me? Even though she smoked, she a big girl. She just got that extra, I'm not losing because I'm, I'm 100 pounds bigger. So I'm just like, damn, if I go out there, we might take a loss, mind you. So she hit my grandma with a, with a, with a good jump, but I'm like, damn, this ain't, this ain't my battle. You feel me? I know my my job is to hold this door closed till my mom get here, you know? So I held the door closed or whatever. I fell asleep right there. I'm going to keep it a buck. Next day, I fell asleep right there. Oh, my grandma ended up um, trying to kick my aunt out that night. She called the cops. My aunt said, I ain't going nowhere. Just turned the third. They asked my grandma to see the, lit, the lease. My grandma lost the lease. Um, so they couldn't kick my aunt out because they was trying to take words. They trying to tell them just stop fighting, just that and the third. Now my aunt saying she run this shit. All this happened. I fall asleep by the door. I, I, I get woken up by the door getting pushed open. Boom. My aunt came in with a belt with some spikes on it and whooped my ass. She whooped my ass so bad that I apologized so I can stop getting my ass whooped. My mom came back. I told my mom the story. Her and my mom started arguing. My mom like, yeah, that's why I want to get out of here. I want to go. My 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 aunt Sandra like, yeah. Fuck y'all. Just then, her all this, all this. <laughs> Shit just was hectic. But that's the story time, y'all. It's a little shorter because I usually respond to y'all comments, get off topic, but. I hope y'all enjoy it. Um, I am going to be bringing y'all story times off of stream because my real supporters watch it on stream. They want to drop on YouTube. They already saw it. I don't know. Uh, get this to 10K likes and I'll do a story time with somebody that the story time is about. If y'all get this to 10K likes. I love y'all boys. We on a road to 400K. If you're watching this right now and you enjoyed the story time, if you laughed even one time, subscribe. You know, and send this to two friends. I'm trying to hit 400K. My dream is to hit a million. We're going to do it. I love y'all, boys. I'm out. It's the look in the eyes. Sometimes I'm peeping the time. And that's the stress. This shit is a mess. I'm fine. Yes, I'm beating the eyes. From Philly, I do what I want. They don't recommend or push me to get me the top. These niggas, they not even kin. They want you to win. But false, we beating the lot. That shit really took me a man. They don't the men. I peep like them on the prize. I'm rock IGs. I fill up the bank. Who rich and smart. It feel like a crime. They ask if I love. I'm all in the park. I'm walking. Yeah, on JFK Drive. I take it or crate. T-Doors a drink. Got Davis. Yeah, we feast with our eyes. Like, no, you don't get it.